Previously on Danganronpa 2. You're my very first friend. Oh, oh, oh. We got a bro hug, man. It's got love between two guys. And now on to the bonus stuff. Hello! Sneaky B, back with some more Danganronpa 2. We last left off, we finished off the uh, Demon Child's, uh, yeah, free time event. Yes, I. <laughs> God dang it. It always, it always takes me a second. I always want to say, I always want to say social link, then I always want to say quick time of it. Uh, and then I also finished off, uh, Kuz Kuzier's. Now I'm working on, I'm working on Terra Terrors and Kazuichi's. But you know what? I think we need something else to balance it out. So since I've, I've gotten an odd number left, I think I'm going to do, th this time I'm going to do three at once. And then, and then the remaining ones I'll do two at once. So, I think in combination with this one, I'm going to do, where is she? Oh, there she is. Let's do a comedy. Hey, how's it going? Holy sweet content is. Are these things real? <laughs> this island is full of mysteries. Yeah. Might be a tower that reached the heavens or a strong dude sealed up in an electric jar. <laughs> <laughs> All right, doesn't matter what it is. Let's go find it. They say the world's full of treasure. You know, like, I like Akane, but it's like something about her, like, she doesn't stand out maybe as much as some of the other ones. I, I don't know, like... I think she's nice. I think she's. I like how she's sort of carefree and sort of doesn't give a fuck about anything. I spent today getting dragged around by Akane while we searched for treasure. Looks like Akane and I grew a little closer. Should I give her a present? Ah, <laughs> definitely. Actually, some of you. Actually, one of you guys said that I. For the first time, there's no reason to give him a present or something. Um, I, I thought. I thought like it carried over. Um, like their affection for you. Like, if you gave him a gift, even if it didn't matter for that time, it'll still, like, carry over. But maybe not. So, let's just try not giving a gift. Hand it over, Hajime. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Hey, you. Huh? What? Um. Uh, what's your name again? <laughs> <laughs> I guess this is back when we just met, because I'm pretty sure I remember your, game by the, your name by the end of the game. It's Hajime. Hajime Hinata. <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. That sort of sounds like your name. <laughs> She got kind of demon teeth too, kind of like Kazuichi. Not quite as sharp and demony, but when she smiles, you can see like, kind of like, like things on the side. Sorry, sorry, I keep forgetting somehow. You're so bland and boring. I remember it easy if you give me, if you give me food or something. <laughs> it's like what are you doing to a dog or something? Are you an animal or something? Yeah. Oh well, later. Huh? Wait, hold on. We only just start talking. We haven't bonded any. Give me your hope fragments. I knew you were keeping it between your cleavage. Well, even so, I'm not interested in someone who looks like they have low fight power. Are you, talk are you talking about me? Please! Hajime has Super Saiyan power! Let me show you! <laughs> Holy shit! Alright, now I'm super attracted to you. Let's get naked. Okay! <laughs> Whip at my man's nut. He's sort of like Popeye. He bites into a man's nut or something. Instead of biting into... Or eating cabbage or... What, it was cabbage? No, it was spinach. So he bites into his man's nut and it turns into a fucking Super Saiyan. Just look at you probably around a two. I don't do anything lower than trash, you know. What kind of measurement system is that? Like, why are you focusing on fighting power? That doesn't matter in gymnastics, right? Huh? Gymnastics? What are you talking about? I mean, you're the ultimate gymnast, right? <laughs> oh, oh, that. Oh, right, I do that thing. Set records and win competitions is easy money. Money? You're just doing it for the money? Oh, uh, yeah! What? <laughs> yeah, that's right! I've been doing this since... I've been doing this since this really persistent old man convinced me to give it a try. <laughs> I've been running and jumping all over the place since I was a kid. Oh my god! You're telling me some old man's like, Hey, you look like you got some real talent there, Missy! He's just staring at her chest right the whole time. Really? Yeah, why don't you go over there and jump up and down for me? Like this? Yeah, and I do some backflips! Oh, that's a good stuff. Oh, god! I've been... Apparently, I'm really good at it, though! All the judges are male for some reason. You know, it's, uh, what's it called again? I think where you run not stop through a bunch of cluttered areas. Is Kenny talking about that? So when you keep running as you jump around obstacles and buildings. Oh, parkour. <laughs> Street fighting. Is that parkour? I got it. Oh, that's, that's exactly it. That's what an old man called, dude. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter what it's called. When you get, when you got people chasing you, you just naturally end up doing parkour when you're running from them, away from them. <laughs> I the police chase me all the time. You should try chasing me sometime. I seriously won't get caught. Because <laughs> usually you get, to get into where you need to be doing parkour in the middle of the city. She's pretty crazy, but I'm a little jealous of how cheerful she is. Oh, that's it? 
That's kind of a short one. <laughs> she just, I, it kind of just what it, she just kind of just doesn't give a fuck. Just like, I'm gonna grab one of my boobies, touch me. Uh, go ahead, ah, stick a whole face in there, go booga booga booga. After you, my mostly one sided conversation with Akana, I left the area. Blah 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 Day 23. If I'm participating, I will give it my all. I must take care of my basic mental fortitude. That is my way of saying I'm fucking stoked right now. You guys seem to be feeling fantastic. Man, freaking does it. Here, have some Java salad. Ew, I don't like salad. I want P.F. Chang's. No, you're gonna eat your salad right now. No, it's gross. I want P.F. Chang's. I'm not buying you P.F. Chang's. Fuck that, it's too expensive. So I'm working so hard, here you go. Okay, bye-bye. Son of a bitch, it's not good enough. Oh my God, I've got four days. This is not gonna happen. This is, n <laughs> this is no way. There's just fucking no way. All right, Kazuichi. Kazuichi. Let's just give him this again, because it didn't work pretty well last time. With all the troubles to bring me something amazing? I mean, you're a seriously nice guy. I'm a little touched, really. I think I love you. <laughs> oh, Kazuichi, you know everybody. Ship it. <laughs> seriously, thank you so much. However, I still want those panties. I know you got them. I know you got them in your underpants. No, you know nothing. Oh, jeez, why aren't there any people? Eagles with engines on this damn island. This is real. I'll take anything. Go car, RC toys, baby carriage. Let me take it with something. Baby carriages don't have engines. Aw, oh, man. No, no, I can't disassemble. So if I took apart the whole the alarm clock inside my room. When I did that, I couldn't put it back together. Oh, so there are things even the ultimate mechanic can fix something. Oh, something. <laughs> of course, that sort of thing happens to me all the time. One time I was I was thinking around with think with thinking before I realized I realized I made some kind of car thing. <laughs> For some reason, things I always I fix always end up being some kind of vehicle. N I don't understand that at all. Uh. I don't mind mess I don't mind messing around with the frame or connecting the electrical equipment. Guys definitely need something with a rumble and some bam bam. It's like sex. <laughs> that thing that I always want to have, but never have. Ah! Hey, you know what I'm talking about, right? You know you know what I really want right now? Oh, Kazuichi's probably talking about <laughs> refrigerator. Engine? I'm talking about an engine, right? That's what you want to mess around with? Of course. <laughs> that's right, that's exactly it. I thought I was gonna say so. I thought it was actually gonna be like <laughs> sex or something. It's just gonna be ellipses again like terror terror. Disassemble, reassemble, see how it goes. Disassemble, reassemble, see how it goes. <laughs> oh, hey, look, I'm flying to the moon now. I guess it worked. Oh, wait, no, exploded, I'm dead. <laughs> Didn't work. Doing that over and over again, gets my brain moving. <sighs> oh, God, I really miss the smell of oil. Mm. Right, I haven't really smelled anything like that since we came to this island. But even if there was a car here, you couldn't drive it since you could, you don't have a driver's license, right? How annoying. <laughs> Cougar's in the back. <laughs> That's right, you can't, you can't go drive unless you got a driver's license. <laughs> Also, can't drink if you're under eight. Man, shut up. <laughs> no way I do something annoying like that. I can just get most sickness anyway. <laughs> I just feel like, feel, feel, feel like the feeling of the engine running. I like all kinds of machines, but Vigos are definitely the best of the best. After all, it looks so awesome. <laughs> Man, I really want to go home soon and start working on my bike again. Oh, you've been making a bike, huh? Awesome. My dream machine is seriously awesome, you know. According to my calculation, it's a top speed of 585 miles per hour. Holy freaking fuck. <laughs> Man, I must really must take with that thing. Holy shit! <laughs> Going down the highway, the cop, the cop, the cop is his radar gun out. <laughs> did, did something just pass by? <laughs> of course, it may. the speed actually is so fast it crushes the, your internal organs, but it's still worth it. Oh, it obviously, would be street legal and it's like motion because I can't ride it anyway. What's the reason to ride? They can't even use. I understand that at all? Oh, fragment. Talking with guys, we some more. Went back to my room. Man, I don't know it. I guess I'm pumped. <laughs> Man, I hate being pumped. Yeah, you know, the only way I could see actually being able to do this on the first try would be luck, honestly. It's just a lot of luck in it. It's like keep keep replaying it again and again and again until you get the item that you wanted to get, you know? That just doesn't sound like fun. It's just like, why would you do that? Apparently there's no like achievement or trophy for doing that, so. Oh, by the way, you guys pointed out something. I, I can't believe I didn't even notice this. I'm such a doodle. I, the the love note that I gave Teru Teru is a yeah or no kiss note that's what it is. It's a fucking de a death note reference. Oh my! How did I not see that? I can't even. Ugh, fucking disappointed myself. But a notebook considered to be a good luck charm. Human whose name is written in this notebook shall kiss you. The human who loses this note uses this notebook will lose their heart forever. It's like death note where the guy you write the name of the, the and write the name of the notebook they die. Whoever uses it will lose will lose their soul or something. 
Maybe I should give him a man's nut. Ah, that'd be kind of dangerous, wouldn't it? <laughs> Do you know what the horny, or even hornier, hornier terror terror looks like? <laughs> no, and I don't think I want to know. There's more power than you could possibly imagine. All right, let's just give him another one of these. Cause I can't stop drooling. <laughs> right now, I'm <laughs> right now I'm extremely touched. Even my loins are excited. <laughs> That reminds me. Oh wait, that reminds me. Your place back back home is a restaurant, right? As I recall, you said it was a diner. Oh, guess that's uh, about what, it. What happened? What happened if you're looking for Ruba? Ruba, Sean, he's sleeping beside me. Wait, what? <laughs> what are you talking about? His, this apron? Ah, uh, just as I thought you had noticed it. A Chinese acquaintance of mine told me that he's a karaoke buddies with a Vers Versace Versace designer. <laughs> a Versace. <laughs> so he had this specially made for me. Plus, it was the low pr low price of only four hundred ninety dollars. Oh. He's by the way, he also got me this shirt. It was designed by Gaultier. <laughs> if I remember right, I paid him back with a barrel of shocks in white wine, I think. I feel like he totally changed the subject. I guess he doesn't really want to talk about the diner. <laughs> understand. I don't understand. I guess he must be embarrassed about it. I, that's the only thing I, reason I can think of. If I'm going to serve first-rate customers in a first-rate restaurant, I need to be mindful of my appearance. Yeah, I've discussed this with my siblings, and they agree with me. Mm. But they also, you know... They're also, you know, people who've made mistakes due to the folly of youth. Jeez, it was a, it has to be a mistake for them to admire a job like that. A job like that. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen them for a while, so I don't really know, but it sounds like they're being scouted by restaurants. Apparently, the candidates for the title of alternate male escort and ultimate female escort. Oh my god! Male and female escort? Or escorts? Aren't they underage? Ugh! Plus, the siblings still have that face, right? <laughs> they have the, that terror terror. They have the terror terror face. Ah! Oh, what happened? <laughs> they, wow, they must have some serious techniques. I guess it's probably why they're called ultimates. <laughs> oh, this is wrong! No! They're underage? And you're calling that. Please, somebody. He must be talking about something else, right? Geez, hmm. obviously, they're just exploiting their youth to make a quick buck. So what if they make a hundred million annually or whatever? That is that much doesn't mean anything to me. <laughs> That's right, money isn't everything. You gotta think about the big picture. They think they're so great earning more money than me. <laughs> ah. I don't know if he's worried about them or just jealous of them. It's difficult to tell. Still, did you become a chef to, just to did you become a chef just to make money? No 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 no. <laughs> it's not just for money. My my dream is That's right, I want to own my own restaurant. Of course, that's not all. Obviously, I wanted to appear in lots of TV shows, and it'd be nice to put on a dinner show, too. Well, guess that's about it. <laughs> I'd be Japanese rich Ray, baby. <laughs> Maybe partner up with some convenience stores and fast food places, too, don't you think? Doesn't that mean, in the end, you'd only want fame and fortune? No way, no way, no way! <laughs> You're wrong. My, my, my real dream is, you know, having a cute, similar wife. Maybe? <laughs> We're confused. He looks like he's confused himself somehow. <laughs> I don't know why, but I feel like he wants to hide his true intentions. I don't know what that is yet. Okay. Probably to do with his mom or something, right? He said, did he say his mom was sick? I think she was or something, right? So, why? Wait, so, it didn't end up being something. You're telling me his his younger siblings ended up being the ultimate male and female. Ass what? Ew, it's fucked up. What the hell was that? I was expecting it to be like, oh, it meant something else, you know? But, no! Ew! <laughs> That's fuck. That's just fucking wrong. I had parting ways to tear tear decided to return to my room and God, question my question humanity. I'm like, <laughs> what is wrong with these people? <laughs> I can't believe Audrey's dude's like, wow, their skills must be amazing. <laughs> oh my, God. ew, Audrey, ew. I feel like she might. She, I mean, she loves food, right? She loves anything food. So we got chocolate chip jerky that's got meat, meat in it, right? Thin loaf. Uh, bread stuffed to the brim with butter and crushed coat roe. A perfect fusion of French and Japanese cuisine. Um, I don't want prepackaged orzoto, a dish made from boiled pearl barley. It is very nutritious and high in fiber. It also tastes good with beef tongue. Maybe? Hartet. Well, no, I'm all out of this. I don't know. Should we? Should like junk food? I don't know, maybe she'd like this, because it's got meat, and it's supposed to be fairly good for you. I don't know, like, she's an athlete? That or this, I don't know. I always feel like the early ones here, like, it's like, never give those to people, because they don't see, they usually, I don't know, I didn't think they'd ever be very good, but, 
Um, let's go with this one. Are you serious? Can I really have this? You're such a nice guy. Starting to get pumped oh, up. Sounds like after this one battle will be like stainless steel. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Call me to go be ultimate gift giver. You. You look pretty bummed. Are you? Are you? Are you even eating? Um. Hank. <laughs> oh come on. My name is Hajime. I got the H right. Importantly, why are you so full of energy? <laughs> Isn't it obvious there's yummy foods. Our blankets, my our room doesn't leak when it rains. This place is way better than what than where I grew up. Seriously? You're in this kind of situation? Um, um, you know how it is. It's not as strange as I'd find a dead body at the dump in the morning. Where are you from? <laughs> Trash a place where crappy people are all swept together. Stuff like that happens all the time. How can you say that like it's no big deal? What kind of environment was she raised in? Anyway, so we never had any money. I did whatever I could do to earn cash. <laughs> I was so my use paying to this, nose, to this noisy pig who kept going, can pay in his panic. <laughs> oh my god. So she just like. Oh, see, that's like, like ew, it's, it's kind of fucked up. She's just like, whatever, don't care. By the time I was able to legally work part time, I didn't have to run away anymore. So when you mentioned parkour before, you were talking about that. Oh. What, running away from perverts? It's like, or she mean like, I, I don't know, cops? I'm, is that what she meant? Like, oh, Jesus. I probably just laid the foundation for being a gymnast. What kind of, uh, okay. What kind of part-time jobs do you do? I'll bet you probably did stuff like manual huh. labor. Well, I did a lot of things. For some reason, my mom's boyfriend's always pushed me into doing weird jobs. <laughs> oh my god. This is what they were talking about. They, they mentioned this before when it was like, right? I think I think it was like Mahiru's case or something where she was like, My mom's boyfriend's would always give me, give me full body massages or something. <laughs> huh? Like. At first, one of them told me all I need to do was serve food. I never expected he'd tell me it, to do it like that. Pretty sure Kane is talking about being a waitress, but what kind of waitress? What do you tell her to do? No panties? Cosplay? <laughs> Roller skate. Oh god! What? Oh, what happened? <laughs> uh, well. What's that mean? Well, anyway, I didn't know what to do. I mean, he told me to do it without my panties, you know? <laughs> oh, jeez. I can't tell if she's like. I can't tell if she's like totally clueless or if she just like. It's just kind of rolling it off. But it's just like. I don't know. I think. It seems like she's kind of clueless, but like, it's kind of sad in that case. Like, oh god, what kind of fucked up shit do they do to you? That makes sense, right? There's no way I can do something like that. Of course! <laughs> right, that would definitely make your stomach cold. That's the issue! No, she's just kind of clueless, isn't she? Oh god. I feel like she. I don't know. But she, she, she sort of like. She, she was saying, like, Hajime, like, hey, Hajime, you want a copy for you? The boob or something? Did she just like think that because that's just like that's what guys like, I guess. And but doesn't really like have any like embarrassment or uh, shyness about it or something. Like I don't know. Like doesn't have any shame about it. I guess I, I don't know. It, it, but it's, there's still a level where you gotta be like, okay, that's just not right, you know? You. What? Man, you're annoying. Talking to you made me hungry for skin for some reason. <laughs> All right, I guess stop being mad. My fourth meal. You said that. I kind of walked away in a hurry. What kind of pass does she have? Oh. <laughs> That's kind of sad though. It's like, oh. I just can imagine like she's like being like, ugh. Rubbed down by dirty old men or something. Part ways is a kind of sad to leave the area for now. <laughs> <laughs> Rejoice, commoners, for today I will show you just how far above you I am. <laughs> I will show you how fucking boss Tagami is. Fat Tagami's way better than Skinny Tagami. <laughs> no, he's not. Oh my god, it's Skinny Tagami. I finished defeating Nagito, and now I've come to have another money off with you. <laughs> Bring it on. I'll use my fake wealth to defeat your real wealth. Ah, 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 ah. I've had 30 beef briskets. I am so ready. Hey, God, do you have a dream of the future or something? I never really thought about it. Yeah, I forgot what, man, I forgot what it was. How about you? Do you have one? Huh? Well, you know, sort of, because I'm a mechanic. <laughs> I want to marry a hot blonde. <laughs> Not much a, a guy like me can do besides tinker with machines. So I'm gonna reach for the stars, and that's the only one for me. To be an F1 racer? That's obviously wrong. Hell no! Something bigger, faster. Uh, oh, never mind. Don't even think about it. We'll just laugh. You'll definitely laugh at me. I already know. See, I told you, your face totally gave it away. You already know what it is, don't you? I'm making a face? Ah, right, don't you get it? Hey. I mean, if I'm talking about the, that, the best machine, then I'm always talking about that. Just don't even think about it. Forget about it already. Do you want me to guess or not? I think he probably wants this. Oh. oh, okay, he's actually talking about a real machine. All right, um, a rocket ship. Yes! Be a rocket uh, ship? 
laugh all you want, I don't care. I'm glad he wasn't going to say good. I'm glad he wasn't talking to me, going to be like, I keep expecting him to say something dirty and horny, so that's the only reason why. I was like, I was like, God, please don't be like, I'm in a real machine, a woman. I'm like, I don't care if that is something offensive. Why would I have to laugh? That's, that's, that sounds amazing. Are you serious? Seriously? <laughs> see ya. Ha. Ha. See ya. See ya. I think rocks are amazing. They're the biggest and the fastest. They're at the very top of the vegan food chain. Well, there's still just one thing I'm worried about. No matter how hard I work, it makes such an awesome machine. There's no way I can give a girl a ride in one. <laughs> yeah, if you get motion sickness in a car, you'd have a real bad time instead of a rocket. But a fantasy like that is, is very you, I guess. If you overcome your motion sickness, I'm totally mad you riding a motorcycle with a girl. You're probably hang out with a bunch of delinquents and get into all kinds of trouble, too. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to throw that in there, too. <laughs> so you think so, too? I mean, it's normal to think like that. Guys, we should something happen all of a sudden? Yeah. Nah, it's nothing. That's the first thing I need to do, so later. I'm just a we abruptly walked away. I don't really know why his attitude changed. I was kind of, I don't know, that's kind of a random thing Hodgman is saying. I can imagine you being a punk, too. Hanging with all those bunch of bitches and shit. I feel like that might have offended him a bit. I still on to some hazy thoughts, it's time to go back. Alright, today's the day. I'm totally gonna do it, right? <laughs> right, Hajime? Right. No. There's no way. Damn it! I was so close to 15 for that one. Oh, also oh, close to 15! No! Oh, look how close I am! Oh, I was so much closer than I thought it would be. That was way... That was so much closer than I thought. Oh, if I had one more day, I might be able to get it. No! <laughs> oh man, oh, I'm sorry, so I failed again. Oh, was it a little difficult? <laughs> Next goal is right here. Holy shit! You're gonna build me a house, motherfucker, and it better be bitchin', otherwise I will throw you all down in a big pit and laugh and go. Boo! I'll throw you down in the pit where Monokuma lives. <laughs> yes, please, throw somebody down here. I need somebody to be my friend, and then to kill their other friends, for my enjoyment. <laughs> yeah, I'm feeling so fucking pumped right now. Oh, here have some more Jabba salad. Bye bye. Usami house. Wow. Holy shit. Well, I almost got enough paint. Everything else though. Rope. Or I got you know clay, wood, and saw. Play wood saw, saw wood clay. Okay, I get the feeling that Terror Terror would like likes dirty things, right? So this is come on. His hand binding garment was worn by the genius ma magician Queen Teruko during her escape match performances. Apparently, there were people who might enjoy being bound up. Yeah, probably him. Nah, I fucking do it. Huh? You're giving this to me? Thank you, Ajime. My best is best friend. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny when he shakes like this. Terror 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 above him. Is he saying that, or is it like the sound he makes? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Jeez, the ingredients on the supermarket are no good at all. It's concerning. They aren't even probably managing the freshness at all. Just a while ago, I found an ingredient that had a mold growing on it. I need to do something about it soon. What would you do, Hajime? What would I do with mold ingredients? I seem to recall. Somehow, I think if I said remove the mold, it would he would just be like, like, no, how dare you? I would kill it with fire. Mold we'll die if you just cook it over a hot fire? Oh, all right. For a while. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's what the thoughtless amateur would think. Depending on the mold, some strains are very insistent to eat. But it really insists that the only option is to cook it until it's burnt to a crisp. I see then. Okay. Throw it away. There's another option to throw it away, yeah. right? That's exactly right. If you want to cook a, to cook a safe, tasty dish, that's the only yeah, way. Done. Gee, such disrespect towards ingredients. This looks pretty mad. I guess he's really serious about ingredients. Yeah. Regardless, I guess it's understandable since the supermarket is on some rural island. Compared to the market in Ayoma, Ayoyama, that is, that I always visit, this store is horrible. I don't really get it, but does it make it that much of a difference? The end result usually looks pretty tasty anyway. You're kidding, right? Hajime, you poor thing. From the bottom of my heart, I feel so bad for you. You've never seen the spark released by quality ingredients, the countless miracles. The sexy shimmer of a fish eye, the, the seductive shine of oil dripping from the meat's fat, fresh ripe vegetables with their smooth limbs. <laughs> Just thinking about that makes my loins quiver. <laughs> Isn't that bad for a cook? <laughs> I really do miss my darling tender ingredients. With my own hands, I want to reshape them as gorgeous, beautiful dishes. 
Woohoo, how about it? Are you getting turned on too? Would you like to make love right here? <laughs> oh, sure, why not? <laughs> um, instead of eating amazing dishes like that, I'd rather just eat normal food. But that might be because of the current situation. <laughs> then that's what I'll make it for you next time. I feel like cooking for you. Huh? It's okay if I obviously make an obviously cliched meat and potato stew with no fun flavors at all, right? I think it's a perfect dish for you, since you sort of look like a potato yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a potato, you're a potato! You look like a jelly donut. <laughs> well, that all depends. That all depends if I feel like making it, so just wait patiently and look forward to it. I feel like you slipped in a snack comment about me just now, but <laughs> he look he look kinda like a potato. With a big with a big stim on his head. <laughs> a meat potato stew made by the ultimate chef. I'm looking forward to seeing the end result. Oh. Yummy. Probably was Terry Terry, who seemed to be in a strangely good mood and returned to my cottage. Holiday day 28! Okay, she seemed to like this, so I'm just gonna give her some more of it. Huh? Well, this is awesome! What the heck is it? <laughs> You're giving this to me for free? I feel kinda bad. Hey, <laughs> thanks. Hmm. Hey, you! You're like really small, um. Harvey? <laughs> oh, come on! Come on, Akana! Even by the end of the game, you had me figured out by this point. It's Hajime! <laughs> Oh, right, that's it. I was close, though. Anyway, are you are you even eating? <laughs> I don't really have much of an appetite, but I am eating regularly. Uh, I see, then it's okay. Whenever I see small things I don't like to eat much, I, I, can't help, I can't help feel worried. You can't survive if you don't eat when you can, you know. Well, sure, the eating is necessary, but aren't you going a little overboard? Wait. Of course not. That's normal back home. Hey, Connie. I've been wondering about this for a while, but about your home. What? Oh, oh it's not that big a deal. The only major difference that I have about... Seven little brothers and sisters, my parents don't work. Holy shit! The only thing- What the fuck?! So annoying. You know how every time you get a new mom or dad, you get new siblings, too? Oh, I see. So, uh, so that mom keeps remarrying, I guess. Well, that's why I don't re know, really know exactly how many siblings I have. <laughs> that's really messed up. She just talked about so nonchalantly, too. It seems so life-scarring, all these things she's talking about. You took a part-time job to support your family? <laughs> yep, I gotta feed the little ones, you know? Yeah. Oh. No, I've just got a... It doesn't show so much sweeter side to Akana that you don't really get to see. When I have my waitress gig, I sometimes steal. I mean, bar leftovers spring home. I gotta pay an hourly wage. I also got tips, too. It's pretty sweet. <laughs> oh, and I got to keep my panties on, too. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I didn't like Custis motorboat me, either. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Not like all my, my, my mom's boyfriends, apparently. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> of course! <laughs> huh? Why are you so mad? I mean, you're a girl. Don't talk about, don't talk about keeping your panties on so casually. Oh, uh, I see. Um, sorry. No, um, I'm sorry, too. I shouldn't have asked, asked such personal questions. <laughs> oh, this is so awkward. Yeah. Oh, I remember now. I've been dealing like this before. Back when I was waiting tables, there was this one weird old dude who used to come all the time. He was a gymnastics coach. He wasn't really into sports, and it was not gymnastics. Huh. No matter how much I punched and kicked him, he was pretty persistent. In fact, he looked like he was enjoying it. <laughs> Kid telling me how I, how I had an amazing, amazing body. <laughs> oh my god. He was a seriously gross old dude. I still beat the fuck out of him. <laughs> pretty sure I killed him. Anyway, that's the end of the story. <laughs> but like, see, I was able to move out with my, my siblings and find a home for us. I see. I think that's good, though. Okay, so the... So that's how she got in gymnastics, was through that old... It's so it was an old perverted dude? Yeah. I think I'm actually gradually starting to understand Akana a little better. Ooh, Akana's got kind of a messed up life. I feel really bad for her. It's a little, like... I mean, she's so upbeat about everything. Man, that's, just, that, man, that's why she is so upbeat about everything. She has to be. <laughs> After staying around awkwardly for a bit, I left the area. Oh, somehow my heart start losing confidence in myself. <laughs> well, like I had the confidence to begin with. Damn it, what is that, damn it? I want to go home already. That's why she seems pretty depressed, but physically, physically and mentally. <laughs> Get a hold of yourself! Snap out of it, Kazuichi! I can't, I can't! I don't know. Smack in the face. I'm sure, I'm sure there must be some way. Well, you know what they... You know what they... They know what they, colon, I mean, uh, say. <laughs> Where there's a will, there's a way, right? Hot Are we screwed? Isn't that kind of lame? <laughs> it's your fault for complaining! Shut up! I'm trying to help you! <laughs> well, that's true, I'm sorry. All right, let's get pumped up and look for a way to escape. She recovers mm. quickly. And we are trapped in the Matrix. <laughs> Someone have a telephone? Trinity, are there? Trinity! I'm still all the mechanics here. Hear how that engine... Have engines like airplane chips. They're no good. 
Might as well put pedals on a ship metal boat off this island. You can make a swan shake, too. <laughs> what do you mean, might as well? <laughs> that reminds me, I get yelled a lot for my modifying various things at school or at home. My greatest invention was attaching an in uh, invention was attaching an engine to the machine that draws the chalk lines on the well. soccer field. <laughs> but escape through the school entrance at full speed without curving or stopping. <laughs> uh -oh. I see you be yelled at for that. I got to make it by chance. Uh. What, what if it's impossible? Well, that Monokuma Pass's rule is only, is that only one person is able to escape. That rule doesn't matter. Shut up. Stop using logic against me. We will, we will never kill someone. Is that simple, right? Uh, that's true, but can you, believe, can you really believe that nobody here will ever betray us? Start doubting now, you'll never stop. They want, they want to mm. feel like this. Well, obviously, but. You know, right? Humans are creatures that betray each other, you know? If they aren't, then. That's what does that mean? Uh. Sorry, let me think about it, Della. I'm saying that Kazumichi briskly walked away. It sounds like he's suffered some betrayal, I guess. Some kind. Maybe friends have betrayed him. I understand why he's worried, but I feel like he's worried about something else. But I guess for now, I should just wait until Kazumichi feels comfortable talking to me about it. After watching Kazumichi leave, I left the area. <laughs> Rejoice, everybody. I'm feeling amazing again. I had 30 beef briskets. You know what that means? It's Tagami. That's right, it's Tagami time. I said it first. <laughs> Hajime, are you ready? What the hell is this all of a sudden? What do you mean, am I ready? Who cares? Just answer. Are you, are you ready? What should I do? Yes. <laughs> I knew you would say that, Hajime. But when am I ready for Okay. Well, isn't it obvious? You're ready to eat my specially made dish. Why do I need to be ready to eat something? <laughs> Well, you know what they say, right? When food is so tasty that it melts your mouth and tongue, try imagining that realistically. Whoa. <laughs> oh, the horror! Oh, God, why did I make myself imagine that? Why'd you let me do that, Archibald? I got... Something that really happened, that dish would stop being food and become a weapon. <laughs> I like how he freaked out from his own thing. Oops, if we keep chatting about pointless things, my wonderful dish would get cold. Now then, here you go. But that territory revealed a Tupperware container. Where he... Before you even opened a delicious smell that words can't describe flooded the area. Is this what you were talking about before? My most proud masterpiece. Versailles style meat and potato stew cure de beau. De beauf. De beauf. Go on, try some. The name ma makes me uneasy. It smells like a normal meat and potato stew. In my mind, as soon as I opened the Tupperware, I was scarfing it down fast like a shoulder later. Oh, more. Huh, I'm sorry, but that, that was all I, all I had. More. I, I, I don't have any more. More! 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 Fucking consume terror. <laughs> okay, that was a bad idea. <laughs> oh my god, some crack! It's delicious, extremely delicious. Steamed potatoes that fall apart so delicately, carrots seeping with such gentle flavor. Mm, onions that are neat have nearly melted. Tender meat, purple amount of fat cling to it. Oh, it's so good! Oh. Everything combined to form such perfect harmony. Why do I have an erection right now? I don't care. Ah. I've never eaten such a delicious stew my whole life. No, did I somewhere? <laughs> well, obviously it's delicious. After all, I'm the one who made it. That that may be obvious, but it's not just delicious. This tastes. How should I put it? It reminds me of something I forgot. After I coolly finished eating, Terry Terry silently stared at me for some reason. You you sure say such interesting things. Yep, I think I have a general idea of what you like. So what should I make you next time? Zodiac style be boiled at ed edifice, or no, how about Aztec style mackerel simmered in miso de poke? The names all sound suspicious. They seem like they're just regular home style meals. Could this cooking specialty really be? Ah, uh, yeah, all right. So we're saying, you know, he's not like super fancy, with, but his stuff is, his stuff's really good, but it's, yeah, like home style meals. Part was Terry was excitingly planning and return to my cottage. Oh my god. I brought the potato stew with me and had sex with it and let it fall asleep in my arms. <laughs> I feel like I'm not gonna be bullied today. Hey, you fat coward! Oh, damn it, I was wrong. <laughs> Man, I'm starving. I just gave you food. <laughs> I'm still hungry. My boobs are. My boobs need sus sustenance. Hey, let's go find some food, though. <laughs> Hector? <laughs> oh, come on! <laughs> Hajime. I wanna believe she's just playing with me and doing this on purpose. <laughs> hey, Hajime, I found a place that might have a lot of awesome things. Come on, let's go! I got grabbed me by the arm and dragged me too. Uh, the storage, the storage room inside the old yeah. building. Hey, remember when this, this is where Fat Tagami died? No, I didn't. I'm still here. <laughs> Mommy, let you, let you in if you just ask her. She sure, sure is a pushover. 
find out there's canned food here. Isn't that awesome? Since there's no one here, you, you can stick I mean Bob as much as you want. Ooh, it's a ca ah, it's a canned food party. Woo! <laughs> Kai's eyes lit up with by, from being surrounded by food. She sort of looked like a little kid. She looks this happy. It's hard for me to want to stop her. Ha, ah, score! Things don't make sense. The only thing I can do is stuff my face. As long as I can eat and move my body, that's when I feel like I'm alive. That's all I need. That's Farrakhani, I think, but is that really okay? For people, things are never that simple. She might have something on her mind. So now she's trying to convince herself. Maybe what she really means is... Are you worried about something? Huh? Huh? What are you talking about? I don't really worry about things. Yeah. No way I'd ever worry about anything. <laughs> really? Everybody has things they worry about. People feel hesitant or uneasy. As long as you just need to vent about it. Yeah. That's wrong. I'm not that weak. Uh, click. Can I swung her arm and hit the light switch. It's like really dim, but I, I could, sh I should still be careful. Huh. Bam. <laughs> Ow, and I've already walked to a shelf. <laughs> oh, what's this white thing? Oh. Kia! <laughs> huh? So I managed to turn on the light, and I saw Akane crash on the ground, trembling next to a white sheet. Probably fell from the shelf when I walked into it. Oh. Go, 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 ghost! It's not a ghost, it's a sheet. Bye. I'm not lying, see, look at your feet. Right? D damn it! Forget what you just saw, you saw just now. Huh? Tell me what, I, I, I'll kill you. Bye. If I even catch you thinking about it, I'll kill you. I'll get you for this. <laughs> I don't know if I should remember this or just forget about it. But I never thought I'd see, I'd ever see Akana make a face like that. <laughs> oh no, ghost! <laughs> Someone call Scooby Doo! For some reason my heart was still racing, so I left the area. Uh, I feel different today. I'm all fired up. Cause it with your mouth, go! Uh, I'll drink. I don't think I'm wrong before. For now. Hey, uh, let's go somewhere else. She said that Kazuji walked away by himself. Right after Kazuji, I arrived at the beach. N Who? Ah. What are you doing? Shut up! Shut okay. up! Casey, I'm breathing deeply. Doing my breathing exercises. Ooh. I gotta prepare myself for lots of reasons, you know. All right, I'm ready. Come at me, girl. <laughs> no, hold on. I, I don't really understand what's going on at all. We're gonna fight. It's like, it's like Yosuke and you from Persona 4. Just like that. So his men just gotta fight for no reason. Hey, hey, hey! Dumbass, isn't it obvious? There's only one thing for two men to do when they come to the beach. What? What do you make it do? Fist fight. Hit on girls. <laughs> I just gotta say this. Date? I see. This is a date, huh? That's right. <laughs> That's right. Two people have flown to the beach. We'll once you get closer to each other. And then... <laughs> Wait, you and me? What happened if I dream about that tonight? <laughs> I'll make the pay. I'll make the pay for this. I just wanted to like the middle. What do men do? Fist fight? Hit on girls. I know. Hit on girls, That's right? right. That's right. This is an open travel will be easy. You can run full steam ahead. Well, all the little ladies. Wait, what the hell? There's no old ladies here in the first place. Yeah, you're so funny. Okay, let's do this fight. Talk about a fist fight? Uh, no, not exactly. You're you're going to punch yourself, huh? You. If you don't mind. If you don't. If you don't mind, my won't be settled. Feels like I feel. I feel. It's like I feel lost. Son. You believe me, but I can't believe in you at all. It's like I betrayed you or something. Yes, we. <laughs> Hey, to be honest, I'm wearing contacts. What is this now? It's not my hair is this color because I wanted to look like this. I wasn't really sure what I wanted, so I tried a few things and ended up like this. Mm. I was always a weak, cowardly kid. All I ever did was stu study and tinker with machines. So I always believed that everyone who thought of me was a nice person. So even if I was betrayed or lied to, I always believed they had a good reason for it. Uh -huh. That's what I always believed. All because I was too scared to admit it. Kazuchi, I know, is a confident, happy-go-lucky guy who gets carried away a little sometimes. But me, he's just been pretending to be like, like that all, all, just pretending to be like that. When I was in middle school, there was this guy I thought was my best friend. We always did everything together, and I could talk to him about anything. But one time, I let him cheat off my test because he begged me for help. But we got caught. Till the very end, he insisted I was the one who willingly gave him the answers. But as long as he didn't get punished, I really didn't mind sharing my answers with him at all. Man. Oh. But ever since that happened, he kept avoiding me. Wonder why? It's not like I, it's not like I really cared. Maybe you felt guilty. You probably couldn't Maybe. stand it. Yeah, now I'm older, I feel like I understand a little. But at the time, I was fed up with everything, so I decided to get rid of all that, including my looks. When that happened, everyone who used to hang out, hang around me, started keeping their distance. And 
punk ass is starting looking closer to me instead. I ah, see, I knew it. Oh. So then I haven't needed to believe in anyone. I haven't been, I haven't been betrayed. <laughs> it's really easy. You'd be surprised how much changes when you change your appearance. Hot girls kept coming on to me too. But to tell you the truth, it scared me a little. As <laughs> wish you never, I never felt betrayed by you. I mean, you always believed in me, didn't you? <laughs> well, after hearing your reasons, I think it's fine. So how about this? If you ever betray us and make us sad, I'll punch you as hard as I can, got it? I'm gonna punch you so fucking hard right in the nuts. <laughs> huh? Bring it on, I'll make you eat, you, you eat those <laughs> words. Oh, thanks, because I, because of you, I understand now. What I really had all along wasn't being betrayed. I had myself for being too weak to believe Whatever in Whatever happens, I'll believe in you. That is what being friends is all about. <laughs> what about in chapter three or four or whatever it was when you like thought I was a traitor? Eh, forget about that part. Let's definitely get out of here. All of us. Yeah, definitely. Kazuichi offered his hand, I gripped it firmly. This time I felt a strong, definite bond form between Kazuichi and me. And I... <laughs> It'll be different if you act suspicious. Even if you're my friend, I'll die if you're suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> so here, see, that explains uh, why I acted that way in Chapter 3 or 4 or whatever it was. <laughs> D damn it. As we report card's been updated. <laughs> Yay, you've unlocked skill crap work. Pat yourself on the nuts. Ah! That's his underwear? Looks like a swimsuit. Boxers, I guess, but staring at the sea with Kazuichi, talk about different things. I part of ways with him. Return to my cottage. Let's right, see what we got. Kazuichi's favorite trunks. Popular brand among mechanical men due to his repair repair the now, create the now at a campaign. A kind of feel shines kind of feelings shines through the colorful design. <laughs> it looked like swimming trunks. Like they look like I, I get this supposed to be like the I don't know, the little lines in the middle are supposed to be like the I don't know, the seams around the, the crotch area, but it they kind of look like they're like two little dangling, uh, I don't know, those things you used to tie the shorts up a bit, you know? Woohoo! Here, have some more Java salad. And that's it, bye bye! <laughs> Thank you. What happened to him? He seems to be strangely quiet. So he's thinking about something. Mm -hmm. What's up? Why are you looking at me with such passion? Oh, I get it, you finally awakened. <laughs> Let's go right in and start planning our future together. <laughs> All through the night, of course, and in bed, obviously. <laughs> Why do you always do that? Well, it's just a little joke. <laughs> sort of. Not really. I've actually been thinking a little. What you said about being reminded of something you forgot. <laughs> that meat and potato stew I made you was actually my mom's recipe. Uh, that's probably it. It felt really nostalgic somehow. It's sort of like the taste of a mother's home cooked meal. <laughs> that's right, a pure nostalgic taste. For me, it's the taste of my mom's cooking. The later she'd always be cooking in the kitchen of the... Uh, of our rundown country diner. S seeing you eat and enjoy it so much made me remember too. For why I started cooking. Just because the dish is gorgeous and uses first rate ingredients doesn't mean everyone will like it. Taste taste changes depending on likes and dislikes, feelings and emotions, memories and perception. It depends on each person to determine what they believe is tasty. I didn't really want the sparkling city life or my stunning success. I just wanted to cook for someone important to me. My cooking was just for the sake of making the person most important to me smile. Aww. Aww, that's, that's so sweet. That's so nice, Terry Terry. Why did I forget something as important as this? And apparently this is actually the same voice actor as the guy at the show. He has a very good range, doesn't he? Like, he does the crazy show, then the subdued Minoski, and then Terry Terry, the horny Terry Terry. Like, and they don't really, like, sound very, like, like, off the bat, I wouldn't have been able to figure out, oh yeah, it's definitely show's voice actor. You know? Like, some characters, like Johnny Ambosh, I can pretty much always point out. Tori Baker. But you remember, right? So I have to do now is never forget that again. It's probably your dream or something, don't you think? Well, it's not like it's my place to say that. Hi, Jimmy. Just as I thought, you're quite interesting. It'd be great if you'd let me thoroughly inspect you just once. Of course, I'd like to thoroughly inspect you while you're naked as the day you were born. <laughs> there seems ever, making such full remarks. <laughs> what can I say? I'm horny as hell. I don't think to thank you for everything. I made something to make you happy. Try eating this. Terry Terry took out a white rice ball. The glossy white rice perfectly matched my refreshed state of mind, which sharpened my appetite. And I won't hold back. Thank you for the meal. I bit into it, and the sweetness of the rice spread throughout my mouth. It seemed unseasoned at first, but when I... But when I bit into it, I could tell it was slightly seasoned with something. It seemed different than what's normally used to bring out flavor. What the world is this? There's no use. I can't stop. I can't stop stuffing this rice ball in my mouth. 
Oh, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. Well, I guess that's well, about it. Well, obviously, I gave my all when I made it. Mm. More importantly, how is it? How are you feeling? Already. Are you starting to feel a little weird? Or maybe you feel your core getting strangely warm. Hey, uh, what is this season? <laughs> yes, well, obviously. <laughs> and that's a trade secret. Knowing that for now, I feel like I got to understand Terry Terry a little better. Is he trying to give me, like, a... Uh... Aphrodisiac or something? <laughs> or... <laughs> Come on, you're honing out, aren't you? I feel a strong bomb form with Terra Terror. As long as we have the spawn, I won't give up. That's what I think. Actually, my semen's in there. Uh, damn it! Oh. <laughs> Cooking with passion. I like the skill. Tasting! Give yourself a pat on the balls. And here, I have my underpants, too. <laughs> I was actually going to give that to you. I was willing to give this to you on the first, the first time we met, but, you know, the game wouldn't let me. I just really tried to keep my fading consciousness afloat, and somehow I managed to return to my consciousness. Or to my cottage. Oh! Oh god, was he trying to roofie you? <laughs> was he trying to roofie Hajime? Yes, yeah, so now I'm gonna have sex with your unconscious buddy. Ah, uh, thanks, Terry Terry. I love you too. <laughs> you little horn dog. <laughs> Niger Bar's feeling really good. Woohoo! <laughs> Yeah, some more job salad. Bye bye. Oh my god, I just realized I need 30 clay. Oh fuck me, it's not happening. <laughs> I thought it was 20 clay. Nope, this isn't happening. Fucking fuckity fuck. So there's some chocolate chip jerky. Let's see, let's see. <laughs> oh, this one, this one. I gotta have this one. So I got one of those. I'll be good to go for 10 days. All right. Hey. Uh, um, Hajime, you ain't sure you've got what you saw, right? What I saw? You mean when we were in the storage room? <laughs> I'll kill you. Sinker's the real deal. I doubt she, she's just embarrassed about what happened. Still, I think everyone is scared of something. This is normally scared. You're a girl, so. Damn it! Stop it! <laughs> just stop it! Don't treat me like I'm weak. Huh? I'm not weak. Being weak is bad. <laughs> That's bad. If you get kicked around, beat up, or cry, and scream. There's no. And th that, uh, and scream that there's no food or medicine. No one will help you. The next time I see, I see someone's name, I might be talking about a dead body. That's the kind of place I grew up in. We people die, there's nothing to do about it. No matter what happens, you can't complain. Ooh. What's wrong with being weak? It's normal to be weak. Humans feel overwhelmed sometimes and even cry. I know I do, so what's wrong with that? <laughs> Dude, I said Hajime is just like the greatest human ever. Like, he knows exactly what to say about everything. It's just, ah, oh, Hajime is the fucking best. I don't think real strength means you don't accept your weaknesses. I think real strength means you overcome them. Weird. When I talk to you, I feel like I'm getting really weak or something. Damn it! I was much stronger when I was alone. Stop saying things that don't make sense. Kane, how can I get through to her? I explain this in a way that I only count that Akane will understand. As long as we, as long as we all run a red light. Too many cooks spoil the broth. Two heads are better than one. Probably this one. Is that something to do with food? <laughs> Doesn't that mean food gets ruined when there are too many people in the kitchen? Let's play this in a way that Connie will understand. Okay, I guess not. Two heads are better than one. It's a proverb. Two heads are better than one. What's a proverb? <laughs> that might be a little too harsh. Uh, okay, are you serious? As long as we all run a red light? How should I put this? You know, as long as we all run a red light. You can't do that. It's dangerous. You can run over. You're right. But I think I get what you're trying to say. When everyone's together, they, get, they make up for their weaknesses. That's what you mean, right? Yeah. We can't run a red light on him! <laughs> God, everyone is so gung-ho about the <laughs> laws in this game. Right, hit you right. It's probably some best stuff like this because she has run your siblings. You know, we could all you kinda you just you don't need to try so hard by yourself. Especially in this situation, we should all work together and do our best, right? I put my hand and cautiously and Nakane cautiously gripped it. Which I thought her hands were very warm. Go stick a mile, I said something similar. But I don't understand, so I didn't listen, but so now, I understand now. You wouldn't speak sense to me. Hey. Wow, hide me. You're warm. This is the first time I've ever felt someone this warm. Ooh. <laughs> Aw. Kind of grip my hand tightly. I feel a strong bond between me, between Akane and me. That's right. We're not alone. We can move forward and overcome our worries and hesitations. I hope Akane, who's been living alone her whole life, is able to understand that. It's just a little. Aw. These are sweet. I enjoyed these. Nice today. I have to go through fucking the painful one of like Zionji's. I got peach muscle. Here I got my panties. 
Now I'm walking around with any panties again. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. After talking to a county about some other things, I returned to my cottage. Well, today's the day. I'm I'm totally gonna be able to make it, right? Right, how'd you make right? Oh yeah, no problem. So close, so fucking close, except not even. Oh <laughs> god dang it. Look at that. This, ugh. I wasn't I was just barely halfway for the clay. I didn't really I thought I need I thought I said 20 clay. Oh, this is oh. I'm doing so bad at this. Oh, was it a little difficult? <laughs> Sorry, Usami. I suck. I suck at this game. Let's go, Liz. Ta -da! <laughs> now that you failed to make me a house, I want you to build me a fucking ship. I want a motherfucking boat. I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. I'm on a motherfucking boat. <laughs> ah. <laughs> yeah, because that's going to go really well. Oh, God. Well, okay. At least I need some of the... I'm using some of the things that I already have gotten before. I need some hammers. Well, I've gotten some tools now. Like, I've bought some things. A double amount of water, double amount of minerals, nature... And uh, also lowers cost of HP cost of actions and raising cleaning efficiency, which actually I, I was looking at it, I had three people cleaning and that went really fast. I think I probably I might only need one person cleaning now. Like it's really fucking fast. Let's see how that actually let's see how that goes if I just do one person now. Okay, only one person cleaning, let's see how it goes. Almost filled it up. Connie's undergarments. The Connie's favorite panties. They emphasize freedom of movement so they don't interfere with fighting. Nick. They're just regular white panties. And then there it is. Peter's favorite priest. It's a, it's a pretty expensive pair of underwear, perfect for someone who wishes to be seen as cool, a cool adult man. <laughs> He's also got flowers on it. Yeah, they look more like like swimming trunks, but I guess they're boxers. It's kind of hard to tell with any guys with pixels, but uh, I never let's see, let's, let's see what people what their moves are. Handiwork allows you to reload two bullets at once. Effective during panic talk action. Okay, that's pretty nice. Terror, terror, tasting. Reduces an argument to three statements or less. Effective during non stop debate and rebuttal showdown. Oh, that's kind of nice. So, it means that certain, um, I guess like the orange one, the orange letters or whatever, there'll be like fewer of them, so you can figure out which one it is more easily. As well as the rebuttal showdown. Although, honestly, rebuttal showdown didn't really have, didn't usually have even that many, it's three. Occasionally, the non-stop debate would. I think if it were three, okay, that's pretty good, I guess. I, I, though the, probably the early ones that wouldn't really help, but the later ones, I guess, it would. Peach Muscle. Increase your truth bullet fire rate, rate of fire. Like your non-stop debate and rebel showdown. That's kind of nice, yeah. Well, honestly, what's, I remember I actually had that problem when I was playing the, the first game. I was like... Like, oh, why do I fire so slow? But I, I wasn't using my focus the first time around. And um, now I've sort of figured that out. It's like, I, I don't know. I don't think it's that much, that big of a deal now. All right, I'm down. I've got four more people, two guys, two girls. We got Fat Tagami, Nikamaru, Mahiru, and Ibuki. All right, so I'll probably do like one guy and a girl and one guy and a girl, I don't know. Might I, don't th I think I'll probably have two more episodes of that and then uh, I don't know. I'm not sure I'll do the endings. I, I would like to be able to see them all. I, might, I don't know. I might try to do them all. I won't show, I guess, probably the stuff in between. Maybe just show, like, what it looks like at the end or something. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. But uh, anyway, I'm going to hit it for now. Uh, like, if you enjoy it. Subscribe now to become picky, 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 yeah. <laughs> Come picky, 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 picky. <laughs> become a picky, picky, one aboard the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. Until next time, guys, stay classy.